mean, like, it's technically not my fault. You know, like, it's it's the store's fault. They didn't put it there in the first place, and I wouldn't have purchased it. Hello, guys. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another Vlogmas video. I am happy that you stopped by. If you have yet to subscribe to my channel, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. We are about to hit the road. I have a few things that I need to get done today. And um, uh, so I'm just going to grab my keys. But I need to find my uh, sunglasses. I feel like... I'm always losing my shades and for some reason it just hasn't clicked like just keep them in one place all the time You know, maybe that would make things a little bit easier, but I mean hey, <laughs> that's me So I need to find them and then I can finally hit the road So I am just wearing my pretty little thing sweater dress and my uh, Uggs furry slides and well, they're not really slides. They have a little strap in the back But that doesn't matter. Let's go find these shades so we can leave this apartment and get our errands taken care of Okay, yeah, so I definitely feel like I looked everywhere that it could possibly be and I cannot find my sunglasses. Okay, guys, so we have reached. As soon as I turned into the parking lot, I saw nothing but a sea of cars. It's like um, an outdoor like strip mall. We have a lot of different shops out here and the place is packed like bustling like there's are, there are lines outside of um bath and body works like long lines well bath and body works is having um a huge sale on their candles and you guys know with me loving candles of course i know about that but i did get word that the candles are going for ten dollars i think it ends today though they're going for ten dollars but sometime um in december like sometime later this month they're gonna go for seven something like 765 or 795 or something so you know i'm not really rushing to meet that ten dollar sale because a little birdie told me something different but um yeah there are a lot of lines there there's actually a little um what's that called farmer's market there's a little farmer's market out there um near the target when i'm finished with michael's and marshall's i want us to go check that out and uh so yeah people they're having like little performances and stuff like it's it's really the vibes out here are really nice today um so can't forget the mask i'm gonna throw this on and then we're gonna our first stop is going to be in marshall's Ooh, these look so soft they are soft Oh, you know, I want one. Oh my goodness. Look at these. Okay, so this is not what I came in here to buy, but I'm so tempted. And I actually like the pink one too. Or, you have a little brown one. I like this. All the holiday stuff, this just puts me in such a good mood. I love it, I love it, I love it. Love seeing it. Oh. Mm. Oh, you see it, you see it, you see it? Because I certainly see it. Ah, oh, man. Let's go the other way. Let's go the other way. All right, over here. Okay, so this is what we came in here for the tree skirt and I don't like any of them <laughs> so yeah yeah absolutely not I'm not really feeling yeah no all right all right so I'm gonna show you guys what I got first things first this is what I went there to get tree skirt got the tree skirt and um then I got the jacket that I did not go in there for but I got one more thing this a card game called thank you can text an adult party game featuring awkward texts something that I also did not go in there for I mean like it's technically not my fault you know like it's it's the store's fault you know that marketing strategy that the retail stores use that point of purchase placement marketing strategy that they always use where like they place some really awesome colorful cool looking things in like near the checkout counter yeah you know that so it's technically not my fault like it was there in front of me and I saw it and I was like hmm that game looks a bit fun like I want to try it
so we're in the car again. I um, stopped at Lens Crafters to get my glasses tightened. I was having a huge issue with the nose pads. Thank God I got that fixed. And then now I am um, just outside of that little flea market that I was telling you guys about. Um, and I'm just about to take you guys in there. We're going to see what they have. It was a little bit more festive earlier when I just got to this strip mall when I first told you guys about it. But it's okay. We don't need that many people walking around anyway. So let's make our way over there. Keys. Get the phone. And we are out. So I just ordered from this company. I don't know the name of their business, but I'm getting the teriyaki chicken and noodles. It's pancit noodles. I've never had those noodles before, so I'm looking forward to trying that. Looking good, looking good. Thank you. Ooh, look at this. I'm gonna make my way over here as soon as I get my bowl. It's a little chilly out here. Like it's the wind is definitely picking up. My legs are definitely getting really cold right now. I think that's my food coming up. first like I sound so stupid because like I kept calling it farmers market for some reason like I don't know what a farmers market is yeah but it's definitely not a farmers market it was a flea market uh, so excuse all of that but I um, got some kettle corn and I got some Hawaiian food I'll show you the food when I get home this was just easiest to show you right now because you know it was on top and it's a bag full of popcorn I should have like specified okay so there's like two things right number one there were two bags left of this particular um type of popcorn and I, the guy gave me the bag on top which was like super crushed so all of these pieces of popcorn are like crumbles right now that's number one and usually like i'm really assertive and i would have told them hey can i get the one on the bottom but i didn't do that today for some reason um and i went over there because i saw that they had a menu and it was like watermelon it had like pineapple and they were just listing different flavors and i've had like flavored kettle corn before like that's what makes kettle corn cool sometimes because i'm not like a kettle corn person but like different flavors are just so intriguing so i went over there and i was like oh what flavor is this it was like a brown one he said uh kettle corn i was like okay and i was like what flavor is this one and it was like orange and he's like uh kettle corn i was like oh i started to get the memo i was like okay so then i turned to this one i was like oh what flavor is this one he's like mm, kettle corn I was like, all right, damn it. Just, all right, I'll take, a, I'll take a bag. And he's like, all right, gave it to me and I left. But I'm so disappointed, but it's okay. It's all right. Um, yeah, so on to the next thing. She is money. She a gold digger. Uh, 18 years and on his 18th birthday. So I would like a uh, tall strawberry acai refresher with heavy cream and uh, three scoops of vanilla bean powder. Have you cream? Yeah, okay, and then for the second one, I would like, um, I would like a grande cold brew with four pumps of white mocha, um, a sweet cream foam and caramel drizzle. And that's all. Okay, so I have the tossed strawberry acid refresher with heavy cream, three scoops of the vanilla bean powder, and then a grande cold brew with four pumps of white mocha, sweet cream cold foam, and then the caramel drizzle. Perfect. Okay, 1072. Thank, Thank you. you. 1072. Oh, my windshield wipers. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, there we go. Alright, so you guys see that we are at uh, Target. You guys see that we are at Starbucks. I'm going to try some uh, drinks that went... Oh my god, these windshield wipers. I'm going to try some drinks that went viral on TikTok. Oh! 
Okay, I'm gonna try some drinks that went viral on TikTok that I've been wanting to try for the longest. These two drinks in particular. It's like a strawberry, strawberry acai refresher, blah, blah, blah. Then a cold brew foam white mocha thing. You guys heard me order both of them. And I am definitely excited to try these because I think it's like the way people talk about it, the way people talk about these drinks and the way the drinks look like, it just looks so delicious. Roxanne, Roxanne. Oh, I forgot to take the money out and I'm like next in line. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Would you like your receipt with your order? Um, yes, please. Can I also have some ice water? Ice water? Yeah, thank you. Yes, yes. Thank you. Awesome, thanks. It's the service at Starbucks for me. Starbucks service is like always like 10 out of 10. I've never had a bad experience. Well, maybe one time. But Starbucks has some amazing customer service and it just makes you feel good. So you know that I went out on the road to go to Michael's and Marshall's and the day was just so beautiful like I couldn't resist strolling around a little bit more and I I'm really happy that I did I, I'm coming back home with some things I did not mean to come back home with spent way more money than I needed to but I'm really pleased with my purchases and I got my SIE refresher um strawberry acai refresher with heavy cream and three scoops of vanilla bean powder and then this one here is my cold brew cold brew with caramel drizzle and white mocha and sweet cream foam i'm very excited so i'm gonna try it right now with you guys before i go inside like i can't resist <gasps> oh starbucks is water you guys know starbucks has the best ice water in the entire world so there was no way i was gonna leave without getting some of that but for the taste test To die for it is so freaking good my battery light is flashing right now so let's move on to the next one but you need to know that one is exceptional like it's so good so so good this one smells good oh my goodness like money was not wasted here like this was money well spent okay money well spent I'm so pleased it's really really good um, I'm not exaggerating. I'm definitely giving you my honest opinion. So, um, on that note, I really thank you guys for keeping me company today. And I am definitely looking forward to hanging out with you guys again, okay? Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit that post notification bell. I'll see you guys again in my next Vlogmas video.